So some of that early util, not that she was in a position where she had to use it, but some of that early util would not have been effective. You see the tag, the flash there. Stephanie tries nice. to swing around. No, Marina shows up just in the nick of time to clean up Stephanie and get the opening kill in this best of three. You saw the support there too. Even running through the smoke was going to be Starry Bun through that nebula. So a nice crossfire to help their teammates, but they're pushing back towards the eight extremities and the battle's coming in towards the gelato side and no one's won it so far. Dueling flashes all over the place. Emily's able to get one onto Ariana. Arc Star gets like landing every single one of your shots with a tap. There's a turret there. You can even die from the turret. Unless you kill Marina. There you go. She kills Marina and that's it. It's Elise. Here's from Exit who are still playing back on site. Woo. And you've got Sorry Bun who's showing up to help rotate out. Emily going in. All oh, the flashes there. Noah Chuliana who lands the nice shots. Pinch. Numbers advantage. Actually still in favor of Dig. Yep. This is actually really nice. It is nice. They've gotten the spike back. They should be able to plan it out as well. And man's talking to me post plans. Planted. You feel good? I'm feeling pretty good. You still have the zero point that's out. There's no more stars. You have a recon dart too. So that's going to, like, look, you just went back towards B main and you threw it towards spawn and towards market. It doesn't ping anybody yeah. out. You have an idea that they're both pushing here towards B main. So now it comes down to the crossfire setup. Again, remember, they're going into two Spectres. This is not going to be an easy thing to get through. They have no armor as well. Rain has a classic. The flash to the backside as Ariana goes in aggressive. No oh. shot. Oh, no shot. How have they done that? They so readjusting a little bit here. You have the gutted light on mid side and a turret instead. I on the mini map is you've got a two player flank coming around towards long. Ariana keep creeping her way forward despite continuing to tip away. Sholiana was so weak, but she was good for one. She takes it anyway. Starbun trades it out. You're going to have to deal with one more as it looks like that is Rain who's playing back in wine. Do they check that? You've also got two players back in hell. Yeah, Rain swings out. Emily swings out as well. Just leaving Marina. From the nade. Ellie doing a little bit of damage there. Yeah, that feels pretty freaking good. Emily's dropped at the hands of the shock dart. Ariana looking to do a little bit more damage with that Sheriff. She's got armor. She's got health. She's got plenty of targets. Can she land the shot? Stay as we go. Pulls him right out of the sky as Stay drops. The 3v2 here. Ariana's just so weak. She's got the HP. Oh my goodness. That's good enough. One enemy remaining. That is good enough to drop things down to a 1v1. The Phantom in Rain's hand. Sorry, Bun's able to upgrade her weapon as well. The too far. Surely she checks that, right? Surely she checks it. She's sticking it. She's sticking it. Okay, just in the nick of is. She spotted Emily. Is there going to be a little help? Cloudburst there, trying to spam through the wall. Oh. Stephanie swings out, and no, it's actually Artstar who shows up in the nick of time to even things out. Shuliana investing the Hunter's Fury to try to tag, get nice. some info, get some damage. Emily, nice shot to clean up. Sorry, Bun. Because you still have that full setup. I mentioned it before. You can now play the even the lockdown for the retake on top of that from A main. Not anymore. Yeah, that's gone. We I wondered if for a moment between Emily and Tolt there'd be enough of a delay. She's only got 17 HP. Nice. Yeah, she's been had. Ellie able to take her out. The Cosmic Divide is out as well as Ariana goes in aggressive. The tap. Just a little bit of eye candy. Make you think about what's going on. The Hunter Fury's out as well as the Flash follows. Ariana turning away from it. She All actually shot rain. it. Rain in a 1v2. She's got a chance at this, fans. If she's able to isolate the gunfights, but she's got to get a little more shoulder! She landed one kill, but it got to half, yeah. Into the B-Link to get these kills. I, I'm even sure Ari Arionicus had the Blade Storm at the same time as well. And now, since they weren't able to use that ult in that previous round, they can use it oh, wow. now. You're putting your opponents in a tough spot. This is going to give you some space inside the site. You can break the door, and you know the last two players are aiming. A very nice. tough spot. That's certainly a bit easier of a spot if Shoyana gets one on Ellie. The tap. Again, there's just so much util. Yeah, and she spams through it again. Drops things down to a 2v2. Make that a 2v1. As Dig managed to rip this round right back in. Sorry, Bun. Brutal spot. Sholiana gets Ooh. three. Right? That there's nobody playing towards B. There's no default going on. It's just going to be a fast execute towards A. They have more bodies there on the defense. And they get first blood. Down a. Get first blood. It does get traded back. Emily gets a second. Marina, oh yeah, waiting for the tap, not able to land the shot, so as the door goes down, so now she's got something else to deal with, but another scenic route flank. Bought it by Thea, you have to react a little bit quicker. And only yep. now has a spike in planet, so they have a lot of time to still play the clock and try to play the retake. We know where she is, though. Second cloudburst, a one-way, and Juliana gets the best of her there, but Marina on the site. 
getting a bit of her own as she drops Emily to 2v2 here on the side of Rain and Sholiana. Again, find themselves in an excellent post plant. We've seen this before. Vans are going to have to take the fight to the two ladies from Dig. And holy smokes, did they do that. Yeah, and that was beautifully played. They try to get a split going this time. No Kiljo Util. Ooh. And no Ariana to work with either. Stephanie dashing in. Ellie's on the other side. Hello, surprise. Stephanie's dropped. The Hunter Fury out as well. Oh, flash at the same time. And Dink from a 140 Phantom. This is not going to be a good spot for us against Wall Bang 2. At least some good trades though, Doug, but in the end, it's yep. still going to be uh, the attackers on the upper hand. The Seeker is going to help a bit too. They have to focus now to take down Sholiana, but look at the amount of utility she also has to counter back. I mean, she, and like, so the, here's the thing, if you're Sholiana here, you're just buying time. Yep. Right? Like, your job is to be a nuisance, continue to delay, force them to deal with you, and buy some more time. Now, because of the lockdown, they also had to take that space away, so they take care uh, of the player. Birds be main. They get back to safety, and now it's on them to continue to move forward. Emily, really, and Thea, no armor. Or, excuse me, no utility to work with. The alarm bot's gone off as Emily with 65 health. No armor to Has to play this tight. She's good for it. She didn't need that. Went on that fight. Or a change of the pace once again. Mid-side control. Denied. Twice. My goodness. Now it's Thea who's on one. Spike goes down. Still 5v3 in favor of Dig. He's weak. Stephanie is as well. I like the turret towards Catwalk too, so that prevents any type of fight that's happening. They could just focus here towards Sliding Door and also towards Heaven. Oh boy. So Emily has now been sectioned off from the rest of the team as they're down in hell. Stephanie drops. The flash out from Archstar. She knows there's at least one player there, but they again with the Guardian. Good for three. Looking to get four. No, Emily's the one who gets that. Sorry, Buns left alone. The site was split. Yeah, here's this is big though because Archstar just got go. the last. Yeah, that's a big kill. Archstar just got the final ult orb to get her ult online. Last round of the half. Marine is already able to get two as well. These specters seem to be paying off just fine. And there are the seekers that we were just on the flank with these flashes in the end. Ellie pushed off. The door comes down, but the flash made its way through at the end. Now Ellie in a more aggressive position, but she only has a Spectre from up in heaven. And she has no util to work with either. Spike continuing to tick away. You see Thea taking a long route all the way around up Cat. And again, when you see plays like that, it becomes a question of timing. Can she get there in time to impact the play? Especially with the turret. off site when everything goes down. Yep. Turret's not even going to look at her, so she could definitely get this flank in. Rain was dropped. Thea. Oh, Thea's gonna get a shot at it. Guardian again gets a second. Artsar gets the last, but is there gonna be enough time? Is Artsar gonna have enough time? She's been tapped a third just for good measure. Get on the A side, but Dignitas seems to be ready. 13 HP, certainly not how you want to start things off, and somehow Artsar finds herself in even worse of a situation where she only has 4 HP. Starry now has nothing. As Thea okay. and the rest of Dig, Sholiana in particular, aggressively work their way in through Tree. They've cleared out that area of the map. Now they can turn their attention towards Hell, where the remaining members of Xset are. A flash that maybe a bit, bit of friendly two. fire. Yep. Yeah, yeah. Thea good for one. Oh, God, right? She doesn't. Okay, no she way. doesn't pull no this way. off. Brain's going to stick the diffuse. I mean, they don't want to prolong this. At all, let's just get it done. And again, been going here. Killjoy all They have a little feels good man themselves. Yeah, Ariana just got one, but then drops instantly. You see Marina on the flank. Emily a bit wiser to it as Ellie's have been pushed out. Yeah, she's gonna get tagged up. But it doesn't look like they're gonna chase it out and wisely because oh Marina's shown up at just the right time. Emily, though, forgetting about the play, looking to get the defuse. She pulls off, though. She gets it to half. They've got strength in numbers. Marina has no HP to work with, and, well, now Ellie doesn't either. And the third round of the second half is huge right now for, especially, you know, a yeah. bonus round for the defenders. So that was very well done. I think that caught X set off guard, too, to have one to get caught with uh, into the lockdown towards A main, which I think is Ellie. Yeah, Nebula is going to slow things down, though. So that, that forces a Nano Swarm to be thrown just to clear out a corner, but they don't gain much information out of th after Dude. that. Which Dig is playing. Stephanie on that swing out, and yeah, she had the, the dart from Sholiana to get her info, but they're just not missing right now. Fans are just not, of course. As nice. I say that, Ellie gets one with the Guardian. Back onto Stephanie. Still numbers advantage in favor of Dig. The spike is still slowly trying to make its way onto the site. There they go. They've gotten on their Sholiana, though. 
can continue to be a problem. Artsar manages to get the spike down. Definitely turns around. Starry Bun in a great spot. Starry Bun good for one. Not able to get a second though. As Thea once again lights up the kill feed. They've all shown up and they've shown up in bunches. The remaining members from Xset looking to keep this map alive. Now they're starting to get out. Ellie's good for one. Artstar good for a second. A 1v1. Emily versus Artstar. Artstar with just one armor for an M. Emily on the tap. Gets it to half. And the spam comes through. 47 HP, so it did tag a little bit. Emily's gonna stick it. My goodness, she's gonna That's stick it. it! That's how this map ends! Soul dig player. There, a little flash, a little dash, yet again. As the pace does not seem to slow down for Xset. They want to go aggressive, and it seems to pay off early on. Definitely, and the plant's already coming in right now, so we talked about that fast pace, right? Enabling your teammates to coming in with the flash and dash. And it works out! They get a nice map control, pours the C site, even the pulse plan looks super clean. What can these ladies do? Alright, so that that's one. That's a big step forward, but you still have a whole lot of steps to go. Yeah, and Deus drops, just leaving Shiliana in a 1v4. It's gonna... It's gonna take a freaking miracle to make something like this happen. You feel yeah. the pressure coming in from opposite sides. Now 37 health. Let's see what happens here. Oh, the paranoia is great. The paranoia is great. It delays. It buys time. Thay is there as well. The dash out, but Rain's the first one to land a kill. Ariana Kiss is just so freaking good, man. Emily gets that, though, and trades it back. Marina looking to get the spike down. Does. The nade, I believe it, it did a little bit, but not. See them hunting around. Emily's good for it as well. Looking to get the second switches over to the classic spots. Marina running away. Marina's left alone with everything in front of her. Her hands full. And her health bars deplete. Plenty of time left on the clock. Next set. We go. A little flash. They want to go in. Yeah, rain drops, but Emily able to trade that out. They have control of the site. Now keep a close eye on Thea. 30 seconds left. Is that camera gonna get clear? Okay, so she she should have spotted. Yeah, she should have spotted. Sorry, but she's been pushed off. Stephanie's coming in as well. They're hitting at the exact same spot at the exact same time, and it's so difficult for Xset to deal with numbers advantage in favor of Dig. They're all stacked up towards B Link, though. Emily drops. Stephanie on the tap. And they're going in. They're going for more. And yeah, there's not a whole lot that Xset seemed like they're able to do. Thea is in a great spot to hold it. Stephanie can be a meat shield of sorts. Might be a lot easier. Dash in with the Seekers to lead the way. There's just nobody there. There's nobody there. The Hunter Fury's gonna come out as well. Oh, nice tripwire from Deus. Artstar drops. Juliana using the Hunter Fury to try to clear out more. Get some more damage. Or potentially some more info. Marina getting the spike down. Stephanie going aggressive, pushing it to the brink. She's gonna have a shot at another one, but she doesn't have to. As Rain is the one who gets the kill. Ellie's in a great spot, but surprise! Roomba's there as well. A 1v2 is all that remains. Sorry, spotted. For Sorry, Bun, and they know where she is. Element of surprise gone. Health gone as well. Thea gets three with the fan. Even now, Emily is still kind of wondering if she should come back or not, but here they go. The Cosmic Divide, the Rolling Thunder, everything in front of them. Thea somehow manages to go through that untapped she's good for two and they are still alive she tried getting a third but no it was, it was actually Ariarchus who's able to get three of her own starry bun gets one as well stephanie's left alone in this 1v3 she's got the showstopper she's got health and oh baby she's going man she's going aggressive yeah that's one starry bun is still so weak too that's a second dropping the down to the 1v1 no freaking shot the there. Alright, so now they know. Arianicus shoots it out. The spike is down. Ellie's in a good spot, too, and Kevy. Stephanie doesn't check that. She's in a world of hurt. No, Arianicus able to get two. Ellie does get tagged up, though. And they're both so weak. And it's a bit of flash to grab some info. And yeah, you've got some. You understand at least where one is. And look at the boldness with which Ellie's pushing forward. She has 46 health, and she's just looking to take the fight to Dignitas' doorstep. She's good for one, but she's still got a lot of work ahead of her 46 HP. Around. She's been spotted 6 HP. Thea gets 3. Dig as a bit of a counter. They're going to get into B, but do they stick it here? Do they try to push to A? That's one pick. They can go if they want to, but no, Arch starts sticking it here. Here's that same type of play, right? Going for that plant, pushing towards the A-Link, and it has worked, and this time they have bodies to work with, too. He leaving one towards Bunny as well. You could do a lot of good baiting and switching from this Bunny spot outside of B-Main and also from Window. You're finally looking a little bit better on this Pulse plant. 
you've got to be careful. You've got to be careful because you have window presence right behind Stephanie and she doesn't know. Yeah, Star Bunny. Sorry, Bunny. Excuse me. Good for one. Emily in that 1v3 and she's just so outnumbered. Gravity wants to pull her off. Knife is going to help, but sorry, Bun again on the flank as we as they've shown us. They don't seem to mind playing for retakes. They, they're perfectly okay giving up that space. A little bit of a different position this time, though. On towards hell, it might be a spot that not might not be checked. I like this too. They're fake <gasps> cages. Just to think that you're going to fake things out to drop down. She's going to walk through it to get the kill. That's really nicely done here from Thea. Dude, yeah, that's beautiful because you play the mind games that you're up in heaven the whole exactly. time, and this is where you switch things up and you drop down. See how the rest of things pan out. Stephanie able to get one with the showstopper, the cosmic divide, still causing problems. Stephanie drops the damage onto Ariana Kiss as she's dropping out of heaven. And she dies. 2v2, though, is all that's left of Shuliana on the tap. Marine is trying to creep her way forward. Shuliana stops it at half. Sorry, Bunch. Good for another one. She's been so devastating from this Woo! exact spot, and she gets another one to get us to it. Especially on map positioning and map control. And they're doing it right now by pushing C, but they're losing B. Dude. Thea, again, just continues. She gets to open her onto Starry Bun. The nice thing is that Exit have taken a lot of space away through long, but Chiliana stuffs that as well. Now Emily's going to get a chance at doing a bit of her own. The flash, the shots! Good for one. One enemy remaining. 4v2, though. Make that a 4v1. Zarianicus, who's certainly capable of making magic happen, finds herself in a 1v4. How is she still alive? All right, she gets cleaned <laughs> up. Could be like a, a cloud burst right in front of her for the flashes to come out, and then she can try to fight back right after. Or that. Dude, the, par the paranoia hit her too, and then talk about clotheslines. Rain gets dropped as well. The spike is now down and short in a, in a really awkward left. spot as Thea is left alone in a 1v5. Not nearly as successful um, as we've seen in the past. And all she's got. Uh, is a specter to work with. So I think you mentioned the positioning that was there. And even with that, right? I, I mentioned it. Rain's paranoia hit Arianicus. Even with that, she was able to land the kills. It was an excellent response from X set. I think the other thing I very quickly want to call out was you mentioned Ellie back box. It's a seaside hit for Dignitas. Cage Trigger. Now, they, so they've gotten this far off, but I love those two cages that it actually sections the site off in half. You can get that far up, but if you don't clear out the back, if you don't clear out logs, and if you don't clear out plat, you find yourself in a situation like this. The denial of information, the denial of understanding where the presence of Exit was, it was just too much for Dig to handle there. Now Emily's left alone in a 1v3. She has that specter, and she has a bit of armor to work with, but the thing is... All of Exet, all the left. remaining members of Exet, are like squatted on this spike. They know where it is. There's no reason for them to give any of that space up. They're just waiting on Emily to take the fight to them. And I, I also wonder, like, are Exet even going to give them that same look? Because this is the second round in a row now where you've got Marina playing on the opposite side. Yeah. I like this stuff from Dig. They work mid, they get a kill, and they get the neural theft. The Seekers have been used. Juliana still has her on the as well. That's why you see her playing so far off, but Ellie clean shots to take that ultimate out of the round. Numbers advantage in favor of Exit here. The spike is still continuing to tick away. Got that little bunny corner. You like to mention Rain is there. She's good for one onto Ellie. No, but Arianicus was still in window. Artstar gets one as well. There's going to be a lot less uh, in terms of disruption on a retake they could do here with starry button because there's only one star remaining on their remaining abilities hey there you go there's that paranoia oh but the gravity well is that what it was something stopped her dead in her tracks i want to say it was a gravity well it could have been the tripwire i'm not sure but the showstopper just doesn't get the value that it was looking for thea though works her way in the garage she's able to get one as things come to a screeching halt you, you see the cosmic divide Splits things in two. The two remaining members of Exet are going to have to work their way through that. And then Sholiana's going to be just the standing. other side. Sholiana good for one, but no, she turns around thinking things were safe and she was wrong. Still a 1v2 though. Sorry, Bun is certainly capable in situations like this. Well, both going to be pushing up Garage. Thea lands the shots. We're tied up. Out here for Dignitas to get a, uh, in a little bit quicker. Oh boy. Oh, that's gonna hurt. Stephanie down to 5 HP. Thea down to 10 HP. And Starry Bun again. She's been so influential. She's been Woo. so difficult to deal with. And she continues. 
as she's gotten three, only two remain on the side of Dig, five HP, no armor on either of these ladies. The spike hasn't made its way onto the side either. Oh, sorry, but must love this map, man. She pops off every single time on this map, looking for the ace, give it to her. Starbun's looking for potentially something quick, maybe through the smoke zone. He's gonna play the retake, gets the first kill there on Kareem. Stephanie good to trade one out though. She's just, she's just so much weaker now. She's got 30 HP. Starbun is in a less than ideal position as well. I like that flash. Give Ariana Kiss this bit of space to work. Nice shots from Choliana with the big old Spectre. Very big old here. They're just gonna go right at each other, and there's really. No other option. You see the shot guards, Ellie on the oh, second oh, shot oh guard as well, and they push in at just the right time. But Starry Bun again finds herself in a great spot. She's already gotten three and ace the last round. How much more does she have to her name? Soliano wins the round for one remaining on suddenly a hit. Oh my oh. god, that was a nice play from Ellie. That was beautiful. Oh, and it's going from bad to worse. Very well, could be overtime that we're looking at here. A 3v2 is all that remains. Ariana can go come her way around, make that a 3v1. Sholiana drops as well. A 3k. Tell again. She's been deadly from heaven, but also from hell too. This time we'll see the commit. She's doing the exact same setup, Ooh. but it's still Stephanie with first blood. Just a bit. But they're killing noise to re-exec towards the A site. Trick shots. Oof. Crispy shots out from Thea. Now you've left. seen both. Both aggressive positions that they wanted to take to try to make something happen have been punished. First, it was Saribun getting caught by the knife, and then it was Marina getting caught. Now Saribun, once again, this time paying for it with her life, forces Exit into a spot where their only real option is to go away. 13 seconds left. They have to get the spike down. They have to do it quickly. They're severely outnumbered, but they managed to get the spike down at least for now. So many flashes right now. They have two flashes combined with Rain and Emily. The zero point to come out too, but it's not going to hit anybody yet. There is that paranoia. They're going to storm in towards the hell. And they storm the site. Just fuck me, Vance. I want to see a third point. map. <laughs> Except I think everyone wants to see a third map. They fought so hard right now to get to this point to bring this into our time that I I don't think I, I wouldn't want them to fall. <laughs> Okay, so no, it's Thea's job is really lead. just to grab a couple of kills right at the end, but no, the timing just narrowly misses, but she's going to continue to go forward. Now, this is where things get spicy, because you have a push coming in from Long, you have a push coming in Garage, and then you've got this is a free 2K. with the trigger discipline. One, two, lines him up, knocks him down. It's just two that remain on the side of Exit, fighting for tournament life. Marina's left alone in this 1v5, and it's going to take all sorts of Herculean efforts to make this bad boy happen. It's not.